Well, hello friends. Welcome to this week's edition of Saturday Morning Crafting in which I have joined forces with Melissa of More Creations and Gloria of Girliest Cards under the hashtag Two Crafters One Design. Each week we assemble, we decide on a focal feature, something we have either alike or similar in our stash. We craft with those items and we bring forth our projects to you all on Saturday morning. While we're at it, we support Jill Norwood's hashtag, which is Satmorn Makes. Jill encourages all of us to spend a little time being crafty throughout to, throughout the week, to come back on Saturday morning and to share what we have created. This is a hopes to get you out of your mind, to get you into a comfort zone where you're um, just able to deflate a little bit and, you know, separate yourself from the woes of the week and just have some time to create art in your space. Um, this week, our focal feature for Two Crafters, One Design was on snowman, more specifically Winston. Um, Winston, the snowman, is something we all have alike in our stash. So to create my project, I pulled him out. I pulled out this die set here and it is called Forest Shadows. This is from his new um, winter release this year. This one is an oldie. I use the sentiment Let It Snow and this is called Festive Words. I pulled out a canvas. This is by um, Crafter's Choice. I got it at the Dollar Tree. There's two in a package. I utilize one of them. And I use this Distress Watercolor cardstock, also by Tim Holtz. I pulled out my Diamond Stickles. And for my inks, of course, you guys know that if I have these out, I've had, I've created some backgrounds, perhaps. I pulled out for just the regular Distress Ink, Black Soot, as well as Vintage Photo. And in my oxides, I used um, Prize Ribbon, Stormy Sky, as well as Lost Shadow. Alrighty. So if you've been here for a while, last year I used Winston on some gift cards um, that I uh, gave out to the area baristas that usually service me where I work. Um, and I am a big coffee tea drinker, um, just warm beverages in general. So they actually <laughs> take good care of me. So I gave them all gift cards. So when it came to creating with Winston this year, I was a little stumped. However, I wanted to go ahead and participate um, and to fully um, be present for our challenge, which was, again, to utilize Winston. So I knew I didn't want to use him in a car project or in a um, a giftable type project because, like I said, I used him last year. And if I'm going to be using him again, if I'm going to gift again, it's going to be something different. Um, so I used him in this canvas. And I'm sorry about rambling, but I used him in this canvas. So let's just take a look at it. So... Here is um, where I just did some background techniques. I sprayed some um, of my, oh, I didn't pull that out, but I sprayed some of my Distress uh, sprays on the edge and inked along the edge as well with my black soot. And then this is the watercolor paper where I just did a, um, I did some blending. And here is where I use the, um, stormy sky as well as the prize ribbon to create a nightfall scene and here are where i use the forest trees i did some um puffy paint on that to give it some texture i also did the same with his hat and came in with some stickles here are the layering elements of his scarf and his broom he comes together fairly easy um, once you get at it. Um, but yeah, so here is my sentiment, which is let it snow. And again, I went in with some texture and created 
the the details that you see here so that's my project for this week i think i touched on everything so let me know what you all think um, about it I, <clears throat> excuse me i think it turned out really well sorry i had to take a drink i think it turned out really well so share with me your thoughts Next week for Two Crafters, One Design, we're going to work on buttons. So if you have anything um, button related in your stash, pull it out, use it, upload to hashtag Two Crafters, One Design. We would love to see what you're creating. While you're at it, jump over to Jill Norwood's um, hashtag Stat More Makes and see what all the wonderful creators are doing under that hashtag as well. We thank you so much for choosing to spend some of your time with us because you didn't have to be here and we appreciate your support. Bye for now and I hope your day is blessed beyond measure. Bye now.